वेलकम बैक टू मूवी प्राइम टूडे वी विल एक्सप्लेन 2003 रोमांटिक ड्रामा मूवी टाइटल द ड्रीमर्स एट द बिगनिंग ऑफ दिस मूवी वी सॉ अ गाय नेम मैथ्यू एंड ही इज द मेन कैरेक्टर ऑफ दिस मूवी मैथ्यू इज द नेरेटर ऑफ द मूवी ही वेंट टू पेरिस टू कंप्लीट हिज स्टडीज मैथ्यू लव्स मूवीज He has watched so many movies and he knows everything about movies. He met twins named Isabella and Theo because of his interest in movies. There were no restrictions about screening. That's why everyone was outside watching the shoot. Matthew also came here. Isabella was standing in front of the gate when Matthew went there. Isabella talked to him. She told him that I always see you around but you are always alone. Matthew told her that he came from America and that's why he has no friends. Isabella introduced Matthew to her brother Theo. After After that they talk about movies and their bond got stronger after some time the police came there and they ran away they talked about different things till late at night while walking on the roads of paris matthew thought that he was so lucky that he has got two good friends when matthew went home he wrote a letter to his mom he is so happy that he has made friends here when he woke up in the morning he received a call from theo theo invited him over to his house to have dinner with him matthew went to their house in the evening. Evening, and their house was so big. Isabella took Matthew to her mom to introduce her to her new friend. Her mother didn't expect that Matthew was coming over for dinner, but she still managed it. Isabella told him to meet her father and maintain a nice impression. Isabella's father was a poet, and then when they were on the dinner table, Theo's father talked about the inspiration of the poem. But Matthew was not paying attention to his words, and that's why he got mad at him and asked him, "What are you thinking?" But Matthew didn't. Didn't say anything at first, but then he forced him. Matthew told him that I was looking at this lighter. There is actually symmetry between this lighter and our surroundings. This lighter has beautiful harmony in it, just like the welcome music. When Theo's father heard it, he was impressed by him. Theo's father told him that in your generation, you have some people who think like him in a constructive way. Theo's political opinion was very strong, and he always thinks that everyone is wrong. That's why his father mocked him, and they argued. Actually. Isabella's father and mother do not stay here since he's a poet they keep visiting here and there Theo and Isabella stay alone in this house at night their father signed a check for them and left after their parents left Matthew stayed Isabella kissed him and asked are you staying here and Matthew decided to stay when Theo and Matthew were talking to each other we saw that they always have a conflict between them they do have conflict in their opinion but it doesn't mean that they can't be good friends still they have so many things in common tonight matthew stayed in their house at night when he went to the toilet he looked at theo's room isabella and theo were totally naked on the bed theo found it very strange and went to bed in the morning isabella rubbed matthew's eyelids and woke him up matthew asked her who woke someone up like this she said i was always wake up theo like this matthew found it so strange after that isabella told him to get to the bathroom with her while matthew was brushing his teeth isabella came there and touched his lips and said they are so beautiful on the other side theo told matthew that you live alone if you want you can stay here with us matthew asked isabella that did she have any problem with this isabella said actually it was my idea isabella was present there but still theo started talking theo and isabella think they are parts of themselves when they were born their bodies were connected to each other and that's why they are not ashamed of each other matthew thought that they had a physical relationship but no they do not think of themselves as individual in their mind matthew agreed to stay with them and shifted all his stuff here one day when they were hanging out they played a game in this game one will tell a dialogue from a movie and the other will have to guess the name of the movie if they cannot guess the movie then they will have to complete a dare in an old movie the characters ran from the art museum and went outside that they did it in such a short time that's why they got the idea of doing this matthew was scared that if he got caught then he would be sent back to america but the twins convinced him and he did he did it they were happy with their strange lifestyle Matthew feels a bit uncomfortable with the relationship between Theo and Isabel. He does not understand what's going on between them. One day he asks Theo, "How do you two even stay like this?" 
Theo told him everything about how their bodies were connected when they were born and how they think they are not individuals from each other. One day they were hanging out and played that game once again. This time Theo did a scene of a movie but Matthew and Isabel could not recognize the scene and that's why Theo dared them to have sex in front of him. Matthew got scared after hearing this and said please don't involve me in this. Isabella took off her clothes in front of Matthew and Theo but Matthew didn't want to do it. That's why he ran away from there. But Theo stopped him. Matthew and Isabel hit sex in front of Theo. And it was the first time Isabel hit sex. Theo saw this with his own eyes. After that, Matthew and Isabel continued their relationship. One day while they were on bed, Matthew asked her why you and Theo are like this. Isabella said, we have loved each other from our childhood. Matthew asked her, what will you do if your father finds out? She said she would kill herself. One day Theo and Matthew were talking to each each other. Matthew told him that two are very close to each other but still you two made me your own family. Theo told Matthew that I like you but I never think that you are part of our family. You are our friend but still me and Isabel were together and always will be. Matthew found it very strange but still he let it go. Isabel and Theo live a very costly life. They drink so much expensive wines and do so many expensive acts. That's why they need so much money. Their father gave them some money but but now they had no money left. They had no money to eat their food. Now they work somewhere. He blamed all the Americans for this. Matthew said, no, this is not what you think. We are forced to do so. President orders us to go to war. And if someone does not go, then he will be sent to jail. That's why Matthew came here in Paris to complete his study. The time period of this movie was from 1960. Matthew said that I don't believe in violence. If we want to evolve, we need to do it with peace. But Theo disagreed with him. Isabella stopped them and asked Matthew to do you love us and do you have any proof about it? Matthew asked her what kind of proof do you want? Isabella told him that me and Theo want to shave your pubes. Matthew got so mad at them and told them whatever you two are doing it is wrong. You guys always act like kids. You guys need to grow up. He told Isabel that you don't know anything. You have never had a boyfriend and that's why you never went on a date. You do whatever Theo tells you too. Matthew took Isabella on a proper date. When they came back home, they saw that Theo was with girl girl. Isabella heard the sound of them having sex. She felt disturbed after hearing this and felt so jealous. Isabella cried so much. In the next scene, we saw that Theo and Matthew were drinking wine. Theo was talking about it. Matthew told him that I don't believe what you say. You just talk about policy, but you never go to the street. Nothing will happen if you just keep talking. If you want actual changes, then you will have to go to the streets in protest. After some time, Isabella came there and took the hall room. When Isabella and Theo were kids, they were used to making tents and then they would sleep there. She took them to the tent and fell asleep there. In the morning, we saw that their parents came back. They found the three of them inside the house. They had assumed what they were doing inside the tent. Their father felt up so upset, he didn't wake anyone up. He signed the check and then left. Isabella woke up so late in the morning and found the check. She realized that her mother and dad had come there and from now on they can never talk to their face ever again. She felt so guilty about it. She went to the kitchen and decided to light the whole house on fire with a gas pipe. She opened the gas pipe but down in the street people were protesting and a stone got inside the kitchen by breaking the window. Matthew and Theo also woke up and joined the protest. The police were standing in front of them and they were trying to stop the protester. Theo decided that they if he wants to break the barrier, then he must choose violence. They went ahead and threw rock at the police. Matthew tried to stop him, but he could not. Isabella also went ahead and with Theo. Matthew cannot take part in the protest since he was an outsider. That's why he ran away from the protest. The police also charged them. All of them ran away. Hope you enjoyed it. As always, until next time.